Dear friends, welcome to my video. In this video, we will see how to load a file from external storage to input stream in your Android app. So let's begin. We will create a new project. Name this project file to input stream and then click on finish. Wait for the environment to load. It may take a while. Once the environment loads, Okay, it is still loading. It may take a while. Uh, in Pilot, what I'll, I can do it is I can. Okay, environment is loaded up. So I'll do one thing. I'll start the emulator also in panel on the right hand side so that it can load up. And I'll continue in my code. So first and foremost, I'll give some or define the definition required. I think the only def, uh, only permission which will be required is the read media images. So we'll declare that in in manifest file and also in the on create method we can uh, put it so okay so right hand side this is coming up i'll just minimize this so that or yeah so emulator has come up i'll minimize it for the time being i'll come to this emulator shortly but let me come to this uh, permission part request permission context is this which is a present application and new string and i can just go back here and the image or the permission is media image so control v it may ask you to press alt enter to import the required library and then package manager permission granted yeah this is only what we require no, I think I can minimize the explorer part. In the devices, I'll show you something that in the emulator, if I go to say for example my downloads folder, so I have this flowers.jpg file. This is what will be exploring or to convert it, convert it into the input stream in our code. So let me go ahead. Uh, I don't think I'll need a text view. What I'll do is I'll put a button over here and one image so first let me give the button name as input image to no file to file to input stream and i'll give some constraints require constraints over here okay i'm not sure i didn't come up okay and what else i'll need is an image view where i can show the image okay and display once uh, from the input stream into the bitmap so perfect if i go back here what i'll do is i will quickly define a class variable which is image view image view image view and in the on create method itself i will associate it with the required image view widget yeah further i'll create a public method public void and this is the button a uh, file to input stream you can name this method anything i'm naming it pretty long but it's not required to be that yeah and once i have this method defined i can go back to my layout quickly and in this button on click attribute i can set that method so that whenever this button is clicked that particular method is called from the back end yeah perfect now if i go back to my java code now i can continue with my coding so first and foremost i need is the access to the for a file that we are trying to convert so if i go back to my device so i need the access to downloads folder and flower.jpg files so let me yeah so what i'll do is i'll create a a storage manager which will access the system service get system service and here the system service could be a storage no service this one perfect it may ask you to type cast yeah so cast do the casting and then we can define a variable called a storage volume and this will be taking the from the storage manager the particular volume so i think uh, what we have to use this one and the get index which is 
zero is for the internal storage so we, the downloads folder is what we are trying to access which is present at the zero index zero for internal storage okay and now once i have it what i can do over here is convert this uh, oh first face the file uh, for that so file of import image whatever you can name it and over here you can name it as like new file and storage volume dot get directory dot get path and then we can append the file in here which is basically inside the download folder so download slash flower dot jpg perfect okay so once i have the file now the main task comes which is to convert this into a input stream so what we can do it is we can do something called file input stream file input stream new file input stream in the in, uh, argument what we have to give over here is a file name okay it's so asking to surround it with strike as so let's do that and now the last thing what we need is to show it in the or get the first bitmap out of it so what we can do it is we create a very good bitmap and bitmap factory dot uh, decode stream and here we can give the file input stream as the input and once we have it then we can use the image view to set bitmap image bitmap and bitmap i think that's all if i run it i hope it works let me see yeah so i run the code and let's see so it's asking you the access to the photos so allow all you can select the photos also but better to allow all and i click this button and that's when it ran this code and it's showing the image in the image view but the main part which i wanted to show you is these two lines which is basically how to convert a file into the input stream which is basically just use new file input stream and give the file name as an input so that's all i hope this video is useful to you if you have any questions or suggestions then please put it in the comment section below and if you like this video then please subscribe to my channel thank you and have a nice day bye